Here we are writing the equation of a quadratic function given its graph. And so then we have, we have a formula. We're going to use this formula, this form. Okay, and so we know that the H and the K comes from the vertex. The vertex is H and K. So my vertex is this point here, which means this is H and this is K. If I plug that in as it is, I have this formula. X minus a negative five squared plus a negative seven. If I clean that up with double signs, I get X plus five squared and then minus seven. So those two signs multiply them together to get the actual sign. The only problem is I don't know what this coefficient is. But I need to know what that coefficient is in order for me to give them my final answer. So what you do is you use this, and you remember this is another point that's given, and I'm gonna use the x coordinate and the y coordinate. So the y is negative four, and the x is negative six. And this should make it so that a is the only unknown um, value in your equation, which means I can now solve for a. So I get negative one squared, which is going to be a positive one, which means I have the equation 1a, or just a, minus 7 equals negative 4. So if I add 7 to both sides, I get that 3 equals a. Now notice I did have to follow my order of operations here, right? Do what's inside the parentheses first, then square, use your exponent, then multiply, and then I couldn't subtract because a and 7 are not like terms. So all I could do is solve for a by moving the 7 over. But now that I know what a is, my equation is going to be y equals that a value and then the x plus 5 squared minus 7. So this was almost the answer. I just needed to figure out the a. And now I have it. So I just plugged it in. And this is the equation to that um, parabola.